This is the nerve centre of Saudi Arabia, the royal palace in Riyadh, the desert capital of the country. From here, King Faisal rules. Seventy years old, frail looking but said to be in good health, deeply religious, acknowledged now to be the most powerful economic and political influence in the Arab world. In the past year, his country's income has risen to the astronomical figure of 13 billion pounds. But somehow, the Arab revolution that's overturned many a traditional ruler elsewhere has passed him by. The king's power base is his massive family. They're everywhere. The key one is his half-brother, Prince Fahad, Minister of the Interior, and widely expected to succeed him as chief executive of Saudi Arabia when he dies. The origin of the family was King Ibn Saud, who ruled the country 50 years and created the huge Saudi family. To unite the country, he married and divorced around a hundred well-connected ladies throughout the land. But Saudi history goes back even before him. Right here in the middle of the Arabian desert is the oasis of Diriyah. And it was here in the 18th and 19th centuries that the ancestors of the present King Faisal of Saudi Arabia ruled and gave no end of trouble to the Turkish Empire. It was destroyed by a Turkish army this time back in the 19th century, but that didn't stop the Saudis. They finally threw the Turks out at the beginning of this century and then moved on to conquer the whole of Arabia and Faisal himself was one of the young generals of that conquering army. Today there's hardly a corner of Saudi life where some member of the royal family doesn't exercise personal control. Even at the camel races we visited in Riyadh there was a royal prince presiding, Prince Bandar bin Fahad bin Said, a son of the king's cousin. He's deputy chief of the country's racing committee. Altogether there are said to be over 2,000 royal Saudi princes and they occupy positions from cabinet ministers downwards. This elaborate network of princes and the authority of King Faisal himself is now so well established that the position of the royal family seems virtually unshakable. The only real challenge comes from the fast spreading of new ideas as the economy expands. And King Faisal's delicate task now is to satisfy people's expectation while maintaining his family rule. Peter Snow, News at 10, Riyadh, Saudi Arabia.